Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel or welcome if you are new here. My name is Josie and if you can tell from the background, you already know what's going on. We're doing a try on haul today. This is my first time or I think my first time trying things from Fashion Nova. Anytime I look at their website, they have some really cute things. But in my opinion, I feel like they're made for the thick, very nicely proportioned girlies. And I'm an apple-shaped body, so we're going to see what Fashion Nova looks like on an apple-shaped body today. So this is definitely going to be a very honest, raw reaction. I just got this package like 30 minutes ago. And as soon as the guy dropped it off, I was like, immediately, I'm going to get ready. I am so excited to try these pieces on. Just because like I told you, I had never have before. So you're getting a very honest, raw, first time reaction here. Um, so this, I love the color and that's kind of why I gravitated towards it. But there's a few things that I don't think are gonna work for me. And one of them being, there's no pockets. Don't, don't do that to us. This is such a cute set. It needs a pocket. I don't want to have to carry a bag with it, right? Um, the other thing is, these are extremely long. Like, here is my foot. <laughs> Let me not fall. Here's my foot, and that's how much room is left. Um, so if you're a tall girly, these are definitely going to work for you. But I'm 5'4", and I'm not opposed to getting things um, altered. I have before, but I have to really really love the piece in order to do that and i just don't think i'm loving this one one thing i will say is i love the top i like how it definitely does give that little bit of crop so a lot of times in two pieces the shirt goes way down which you can adjust this so it could go down if you wanted it to but um for me i don't like them to be like right by each other so i like that you kind of can move this one around make it a true two-piece set the only issue is the back, I mean, although it's super pretty, it's not gonna work with a bra. So here's the back. I love it. I like that it is just flowed out like this. Um, but like I said, a bra is just not gonna work. So you're gonna have to do like tape or pasties or something. Let me take this bra off and show you what it looks like. So here's what it looks like without the bra. And I'm not opposed to not wearing a bra, trust me. I don't wanna wear one if I don't have to. But I don't know, for this, it just doesn't seem like I would be comfortable without one. Here's the back without. So this one I feel like, good in theory, but it's just not gonna work for me. Let's try on the next one. Next up is another two-piece option, and I'm happy to report that this one does have pockets. I like this color a lot. I like this like kind of frayed hem. It's on the top as well. I do like this also because if you are somebody that doesn't really wanna show your stomach, then you definitely have an option in this one. Couple things I'm not sure of. So for me, I don't really love shorts that are kind of longer in length. On the plus side to that though, my thighs will not be uh, chafing as bad. So that could work. And then as far as the top, I know that some people kind of undo a button here and then they'll kind of just like put this under. I don't know, I just think I personally would need to like shape it in a way for me to feel um, more confident in it. So I'm definitely gonna leave this one up to you guys, I think. Let me know down below kind of what your initial reaction was or what you think I could do to like finagle it in some sort of way to provide some shape. But this is definitely a great option. Here's the back. And I don't think I mentioned in the last video, but every single piece that I got was in a 3X. So I'll have everything linked down below, of course. But I'm undecided about this one. I think it's really, really cute. I like the color again, like I said, I just, I like the way that it looks, but I'm not 100% sure if I like the way that it looks on me. So you guys definitely let me know about this one. All right, now these are a pair of pants that I would pay to have hemmed. If you are tall, you will definitely be happy with the selections because um, these are, again, super long, like not as long as the green ones, but long enough to where I feel like I would need to get them hemmed. I love these pants. They have pockets. They're super flowy, super comfortable. I like the colors, kind of like an acid wash blue. Here's the back of them. I feel like it might be see-through. To be honest, I don't have any bottoms on right now, but they might be see-through um, potentially, but I don't care. Honestly, I love these. I love the way that they look. And this top too, this is just like a basic black top. I love that it kind of has like this little, um, what do you call it, neckline right here. I like that it is super cropped. I think this could work with a lot of different things. 
They had different colors too, so I might order more, honestly. Um, I feel like this could work with pants like these. This is something that I would wear like out to work on the day-to-day -day for sure. Um, and I also feel like they would work with like a nice pair of jeans. This could work with a skirt. This shirt is very versatile and I think it was under $10. So you can't go wrong with that. I already turned around to show you the back, but just in case, here's the back of the shirt. Yeah, this outfit is a 10 out of 10. I love this one. Honorable mention too. This is like a ribbed material. I'm not sure how well you'll be able to see, but it is like kind of a little bit of a ribbed material. So it does have some texture to it. So just be mindful of that. But I really love this. Next up here, I'm kind of bummed about this one, but this is just the price you pay in an apple shaped body. I feel like this is actually a bodysuit. There's no way that this was clasping. It is not near long enough for me. And that's fine. I'm okay wearing bodysuits that don't clasp just because it's a problem that I have often. And honestly, you can just tuck it in. Like, I'm really not sure you guys would be able to tell that this is a bodysuit if I wouldn't have told you. Here's the back of it. The only problem with this one is um, these little lines are like, I don't know where they're supposed to be. And I don't know if my belly or my boobs are getting in the way of what it's supposed to look like. I'll have to honestly check back on the model. But these all move, which is cool in theory, but I feel like they would like move around. I don't know where they're supposed to go. Where is their home? I don't know. So I don't know about this one. It's probably not gonna work for me because I feel like I would be fidgeting all night long. I will say though, a really good point about this is this bodysuit is completely lined with like that sticky, not sticky, but uh, rubbery kind of lining that will keep it in place. So up here is not gonna move at all. I feel confident saying that, but I don't know what's happening down here. And I just don't feel like if I wore this out, I would feel super comfortable. I know that I'm gonna get questions about these jeans. These are not Fashion Nova jeans. These are from Boohoo. They're in a size 20. I'll try to link them down below too if I can find them. but. Yeah, I don't know about this one. It was so cute. I felt like for a nice night out, it would have been really cute, but I feel like I would just be fussing and messing with it way too much. So I don't feel like it would work for me. Let me know your thoughts on this one. I forgot to say this in the last video, but I know that I have a ridiculous tan line right now. I got a pretty bad burn that's still healing. So use your imagination. We definitely have some work to do outside getting this somewhat even because this looks a little crazy but same pants on this top i love this is just a very easy a loosey-goosey wear it wherever kind of top i love this again 3x like everything is in this video the color is so beautiful and they had a ton of color options so make sure to check it out if you like this one there is not that sticky lining on this one that i was talking about or rubbery lining but I do feel secure in this. I don't feel like it's going anywhere. I don't think it's gonna slide down, especially with the strapless bra that I have on. Uh, I feel pretty locked in, so I feel good about wearing it out. And here's the back of it, just to show you all, just a plain back, but yeah, there's not much to say about this one, except I love it. It's a basic, it'll be easy to wear out in the summer. I would definitely wear it with these jeans. I would absolutely wear it with those flowy pants. Easy breezy outfit, you could put a crossbody on, some sandals and head out the door. So this one's definitely a win for me. Two more pieces to show you all. This one, um, it's stunning, but I think it will definitely take some convincing for me and I'll show you why. But I love the print of this dress. It is really flowy. There's no like form fitting at all going on here. It does have padding in the um, bra. So that's nice. So you definitely don't have to worry about wearing one. I did a really crap job right now on my own of tying this up. So use your imagination, figure like this would be a lot tighter and these strings in the back here would be a lot tighter to kind of bring in my chest and make it um, fill out a little bit more. Um, let me show you the back and this is why I say it would probably take some convincing for me. I am the biggest advocate of if you don't like it the second you put it on, don't put it in that closet and wait for when you lose five pounds or when you think you might have surgery or whatever the case. If you don't love it when you put it on, you're probably not going to wear it. I'm going to ask how John feels about it. My sister's coming soon so she can help me kind of tie it up and we'll see how it feels once it is like really tied the way it's supposed to be. And you all let me know too. But here is the back and this is why I say this. I am not the biggest fan of my back 
and I hardly ever wear anything that is open back. But as you can see, it is like a totally open back. But in reality, this would be a lot tighter like this. And this bottom piece would be sitting more up like this. This one would probably be more right here. So it would be kind of better fitted on me so I could get an idea of what it actually looks like. But I love the print so much and I love the way it looks in the front so much. I might just say like, whatever, the back side of me is not my problem and it's not for me to worry about. You all let me know how you feel about this one. Okay, last piece here. And I was like, maybe I won't show this because maybe it'll be included in my swimsuit video that I'm like gathering swimsuits from various places for. This will absolutely not be going in the swimsuits video. Uh, in theory, again, this is really nice. I love that it kind of does this here. Like it gives a little something fun at the top. And I ordered this specifically because it had ruching on the sides. So I thought, okay, ruching, long torso, they go hand in hand. No, this ruching is for like high leg. I mean, this is meant to sit very much up here, which is fine. I love that look, but I don't love that look for me because I got a big belly at the bottom, you know, apple shape, carry most of their weight in their stomachs. And I do, uh, this is way too much for me to be showing to feel comfortable to wear this outside of the house. I'm surprised I'm even showing you guys, but I like to just kind of be as open as honest, give you my raw reaction whenever possible. This is so beautiful in theory, but it's just not gonna work for me. If you're okay with showing this, by all means, like this is so cute, but I would just not feel comfortable. I'll show you the side and the back just so you can see. Uh, this is how much that is kind of peeking out here. And this is the back. So it's a no from me. It's a very big no from me, but I feel like it could definitely work for somebody. But I am as sweaty as can be. That is going to do it for today's video. I'm sorry that this tan line is so atrocious. I'm watching these back and I'm like, whoa, you got some work to do. But I hope that you all enjoyed this video. I hope this gave you some insight if you've been kind of questioning Fashion Nova, wondering if these pieces work for you. I feel like general consensus for me is they definitely do lean more towards like the small waist, big hips, big bust type person. But there are some things like you saw that could definitely work if you do have a larger stomach, if you are apple shaped, or if you're just not shaped like a perfect Coke bottle. <laughs> I hope that you like this video. I do have some more try on hauls coming up. I am gonna place an Amazon order. I am gonna place a cider order. And then I have been collecting swimsuits, like I said, to do a swimsuit guide video from a bunch of different stores. So there definitely is more fashion content coming up here. So if you like this video, please like it. Please comment down below. Let me know what your favorite thing was and subscribe if you're new here and I will catch you in the next one. Um, Hey girl, you thought this video was over. It is not. I have some rather unfortunate news that might sway your opinion and ordering or trying something out if you've been thinking about it. Um, make sure you read the return policies on new businesses that you try because Fashion Nova has a whack-ass return policy. So number one, there were a couple items that I ordered that were final sale, which that was my fault for not looking and honestly my fault for not looking at the return policy. Um, so the final sale items, like whatever, but some items I could return, but you can only return for store credit at Fashion Nova. So uh, I guess I'm just going to keep ordering some stuff until I find <laughs> some things I want to stick with. I guess I'll order some more of those tops and maybe some more of those comfy pants that I liked. Um, but yeah, and on not only that, it's $7.99 to pay to send it back. So I'm debating now, do I want to send anything back? I might just like try to resell it on a Facebook group or something. Um, I just had to tell you all because, you know, that very much sways my opinion of ordering moving forward because you truly don't know how things are going to fit. And I'm fine. Like the order total was like 105 bucks. So it's not a insane loss, um, you know, because if I liked anything or if I liked everything, I would have kept it all anyway. But... I don't know, like to not get any of that back and I'm not going to wear these items. Hopefully I can make some more money off of it. Or like I said, I'll do that return. I just hate to pay $8 to send it back. I could send it back cheaper probably if I packaged it myself. Um, I don't know where the $8 is coming from, but I just had to tell you guys that because that would definitely sway my opinion moving forward and it will absolutely sway my purchases moving forward. Um, let me know what you guys think about that. That's officially going to do it for this video. So... Yeah.
Okay, love you. Bye.